Attention, all the news in this video are all from around the internet and from our sources, we deliver to you the most realistic news, make sure to listen well and you can turn on the caption. Erling Haaland reveals Dortmund pressure on transfer amid Man United and Man City interest. Borussia Dortmund striker Erling Haaland has revealed that his club have begun to put pressure on him regarding a decision about his future. The 21-year-old ended his two-game wait for a goal with a brace in a comprehensive win over SC Freiburg as Dortmund won to put the pressure on league leaders, Bayern Munich. A whole host of clubs have been touted with a move for the highly rated forward including Manchester United and Man City, though it's been widely reported that Real Madrid are the frontrunners. Haaland has two years left on his current deal at Signal Iduna Park but European powerhouses are on red alert with his reported £66 million, 75 million Euros release clause becoming active in the summer. Well, the last six months I have chosen not to say anything out of respect for Dortmund, but now the club has started to press me into making a decision, but all I want to do, is play football, Haaland told Viersport, speaking after Friday's win. But they press me to make a decision now about my future. So that means I have to make a decision soon. As I said they have put a lot of pressure on me and I have to accept that. I have chosen not to say anything out of respect for my club and the fans. But now it says itself that a lot of pressure is coming from the club, so now is the time to get things started. Under old Gunnar Solskjaer, Haaland was made the principal striking target for United and the Old Trafford club remained keen on the Norwegian superstar, who now has 77 goals in as many games in North Rhine-Westphalia. Manchester United are leading the race to sign to sign Napoli midfielder Fabian Ruiz, according to reports in Italy. Ralf Rangnick is eager to add to his options in the middle of the park as Paul Pogba is expected to leave Old Trafford when his contract expires at the end of the season. West Ham United star Declan Rice has been a long-time target and remains the club's number one choice, but alternatives have been identified. One of those is 25-year-old Fabian Ruiz, who has been one of the star performers in Serie A this season. According to La Repubblica, United are in pole position to sign the Spaniard ahead of Premier League rivals Liverpool and Arsenal. Ruiz's contract at Napoli runs until 2023 and there is doubt over whether he will sign an extension, meaning the Red Devils are ready to pounce when he enters the final year of his deal in the summer. The midfielder has made 148 appearances for the Italian club since signing from Real Betis in 2018, scoring 20 goals and registering 13 assists. Ruiz, who has been capped 15 times by Spain and featured at Euro 2020 last summer, has been used in a deeper role by Napoli boss Luciano Spalletti this season. Rangnick says Henderson has impressed him in training and wants him to stay. Ralph Rangnick has admitted that Dean Henderson wants to leave Manchester United in order to get more regular game time. But, when asked about Henderson at his pre-match press conference ahead of Saturday's clash with Aston Villa, Rangnick said he has told Henderson he does not want to let him go. Rangnick said he has been impressed with Henderson in training this week and with United still in three competitions, he wants to keep three goalkeepers. It remains to be seen whether Rangnick softens his stance as the January window wears on, but as it stands, Henderson is going nowhere. Well, I told him that I would like him to stay because he's a fantastic goalkeeper, said Rangnick when asked for the latest on Henderson's situation. In training yesterday, he had another couple of fantastic saves. I really like to have him on board, as one of three top goalkeepers. I can fully understand that he wants to play because he's in an age where, as a goalkeeper, he should regularly play. On the other hand, we are still in three competitions, we need the three goalkeepers we have right now. I told him that but I can also, on the other hand, understand his desire to get game time elsewhere in the Premier League. Juventus still show interest to sign Manchester United attacker Anthony Marshall in January transfer window. According to the Italian outlet Gazzetta dello Sport via Inside Football, Juventus are still showing interest in signing Manchester United attacker Anthony Marshall in the January transfer window. The forward has already expressed that he wants to leave Old Trafford in search of more game time. 
Man United have rejected a loan offer from Sevilla for Marshall's services despite his demands to leave the club. Meanwhile, he seems to be holding out to wait for an attempt from Barcelona. Juventus are assessing their options to bring in reinforcements to their attack and have maintained their interest as a result. The Serie A club has seen their need to bring in attacking signings rise due to the recent setbacks within the team. Federico Chiesa has torn his ACL and is set to be out for the rest of the season. Paolo Dibola is expected to leave Allianz Stadium following disputes between the club over the contract terms. Manchester United have reportedly offered a contract to Borussia Mönchengladbach midfielder Denis Zakaria. The 25-year-old's existing deal with Mönchengladbach will expire at the end of June, and he will not be penning fresh terms with the Bundesliga outfit. Zakaria's future has been the subject of much speculation in recent days, with a number of clubs said to be interested in signing him on a free transfer or in a cut-price January deal. Man United have been strongly linked with the Switzerland international, with the team's interim head coach Ralf Rangnick said to be a huge admirer of his talents. According to Bild journalist Christian Falk, the 20-time English champions have made an offer to the agents of Zakaria in the hope of agreeing a pre-contract. Falk claims that Man United are not currently in talks with Mönchengladbach over a winter deal, but the Premier League side would be prepared to pay a transfer fee this month. The Swiss has made 144 appearances for Die Fallen since arriving from Young Boys in 2017, including 16 outings in all competitions during the 2021-22 campaign. Manchester United attacking midfielder Juan Mata is refusing to sign a new contract ahead of a proposed move to La Liga. Marta has been in England since the summer of 2011, thanks to his £24 million switch from Valencia to Chelsea. He went on to make 135 appearances for the Blues, helping them to win three trophies. They picked up the FA Cup, Champions League and Europa League while he was at Stamford Bridge. The Spain international, a World Cup and European Championship winner, then opted to make a surprise move to United. The Red Devils paid £37.1 million to land Marta in January 2014, making him their most expensive player at the time. The playmaker appeared in over 20 Premier League matches for five consecutive seasons, before his influence on the team began to dwindle. He featured in just nine league games last term after falling behind the likes of Bruno Fernandes and Paul Pogba in the pecking order. Marta's fortunes have failed to improve under German boss Ralf Rangnick, meaning the veteran could secure a transfer away from Old Trafford. Sport Witness, who cites Spanish journalist Jon Cueva, claim the player is in negotiations over a return to La Liga.